uh, good morning. Um, day, I have no idea which day. It is a Monday. Um, yeah, it's Monday. In Germany, it's a public holiday. And surprise, surprise, it's a public holiday in Senegal too. It's called Wit Monday. I have to figure out what that means. But I've been told it's a, it's a Christian holiday. I'm, I'm going to Google and maybe put some information. It's nine o'clock. I'm going for breakfast. I am hungry. The hotel restaurant has been closed the whole weekend. But today they are open, so I am going for breakfast. I didn't eat dinner last night. Actually, that's when you realize that when you travel alone, um, there are some habits that are actually not yours. Because I'm usually someone who does not miss a meal. Well, surprise, surprise, I, only, I ate a, a late lunch yesterday. I did not have dinner, and I was so worried that I would not sleep. I slept like a baby. So I'm just going for breakfast. Um, I'm craving fruits. I haven't had fruits, uh, I think, since I left Germany. Ugh. I'm going to have a fruit salad. Uh, this is my outfit. Senegal, very conservative um, from what I've seen. So I'm just wearing a maxi dress uh, because I'm not going anywhere today. I'm staying at the pool. Find me at the pool. Um, and uh, I just have on a cover-up, it's a shirt, uh, and uh, my bag, which carries my everything, and sunglasses and slides. So I'll just um, have on my bathing suit under, uh, then this will be my outfit of the day. So let me go get breakfast. Uh, welcome to the vlog. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> welcome to the vlog. Um, I live in Germany. But I'm Kenyan, I live in Germany, uh, and this is my birthday trip in Dhaka. I love it here, I love it here. So, let me go grab breakfast. See you later. Bye-bye. Au revoir. <laughs> best mangoes. Senegal has the best mangoes. Well, Mombasa has the best mangoes. Senegal comes in at a second. Uh, 
they're both good <laughs> i enjoyed it um so these are these are i'm going to the pool so this is what i'm carrying i'm carrying my, i have a towel from the hotel um this book i've read i'm just going to do a review on it by the pool i loved it uh this is a book that my book club is reading this weekend we have a book club meeting so i have to finish it uh, i'm reading this i started reading it yesterday i haven't finished isa so i need to finish it my journal i'm going to journal i have some screen and some how do you call this wipes um a bottle of water uh, personal effects charger fan um my small bag my phone um carry my phone and my tote bag yeah so let's go to the pool grab something somewhere i don't know i i am leaving <laughs> um all in all i'm i'm just leaving the hotel going for a walk 
um, I said it's a public holiday, so I don't know if there are any supermarkets that are open, but I feel like having a cold Coke. So I'm going to Coca Cola. <laughs> Um, I'm going to find a shop or something. So I just put on like uh, pants and a t-shirt. Uh, and I'm just carrying my tote bag because then if I buy something then it can fit in here. Um, yeah, I need to take a walk. <laughs> um, yeah, let me, let me see what I can get up to, what I can film. Let's see. I'm going to walk. I'm not taking a taxi. I'm going to walk. So let's see. indoors outdoors because i was at the pool uh, i fell asleep i read a bit i fell asleep woke up hungry had to move because i thought i would not move <laughs> i had to move to go get something to eat so i just got a sandwich um, and some juice it's so nice to drink fresh juice i had some fresh mango juice oh, i'd miss that and then um then i decided to go find a supermarket because i needed water i i drank up all the uh water bottled water that they gave us here so um thankful thankfully enough uh the supermarkets were open today because it's a public holiday here so i just uh, put in on google the nearest supermarket to me and uh, I just walked. It was around 16 minutes walk. Um, so I just walked there. And it's quite, it's like walking anywhere, you know. Um, and um, I got there and found what I needed. Uh, maybe I can show you what I got. <laughs> Those are things falling off. A supermarket haul. So I got, uh, oh, I thought these were Pringles. My bad. These are called goodies. <laughs> uh, sour cream and onion. That's what I like. Um, then I got two bottles of water. Uh, and then I got two bottles of 
coke because I was craving coke um, and uh, and I got uh, like a strawberry flavored milk so I think I'll drink this tomorrow because unfortunately the hotel doesn't have a fridge there's no fridge in the room so if I have I'll carry that with me tomorrow so I can drink, drink it when um, I'm walking around tomorrow I have a guided tour um, so I have to leave very early in the morning I'm just waiting for the guide to to give me the time that he's picking me up so we can go yeah that's it for today um, not much was done but that is the essence of being on holiday not doing much and it's now 20 past 8 um, I'm just going to brush my teeth and slide into my bed and watch a few YouTube videos. I might read, I might not. Um, I just relax and enjoy spending time with myself. I'm loving it. <laughs>
this is my final outfit of the day um, i'm leaving senegal in a few hours just checking out of the hotel now um i'm going for comfort so i'm just i just have on like loose pants from zara and a sweatshirt also from zara and uh, sneakers from nike suitcase is packed um um, I'm just living with a lot of memories. Uh, I really, really enjoyed this trip. It was exactly what my soul needed, my body needed. Um, I loved it. Um, I, but I can't wait to get home. I've missed my people. I can't wait to hold them and just love on them like um, I should every day. Yeah. See you next in in Hamburg. I don't know or Istanbul. We'll see. Bye. Thank you, Seneca. Yeah, so that was basically my trip to Senegal, my trip to Dakar, which I really, really enjoyed. I uh, used uh, Turkish Airlines for my flight, my hotel, I booked through booking.com and it was um, a really nice hotel, La Residence, really lovely. Uh, Dakar is safe, that's what I can say if you're a solo traveler. I use a taxi most of the time. I cannot speak French, but I, I got on fine with English. M almost everyone can speak English. And um, then I just used the taxi to go to different places that I wanted to go. Um, all in all, it is it was the perfect uh, place for me, for my first official solo trip. And uh, I would encourage anyone who feels like visiting Dakar, please do. It has so much culture so beautiful of course the weather the beaches the people it just reminded me so much of the coast um in kenya and um, yeah i enjoyed it uh, if you can travel to dakar travel to senegal and enjoy everything that it has to offer if you have any other questions just let me know uh, you can comment in the comment section don't forget to like and subscribe to this 